Well, so James is James and I, mostly James. And uh, James is here. <laughs> is doing a horror clicks unboxing. Yep. This will be a, this will be a real short stream, but our memorial days, the old stuff. Opening up the short Pathfinder battles one. Ooh. Which immediately breaks off the base. <laughs> oh, whiz kids. I'll just have to glue it back on. How does it look, though? It, it looks good. Oh. oh. What, what is it, a demon elemental? Wraith. Cool. Yeah, it doesn't stand without the base. I yeah. thought it might. I apparently have to lean in like this to help avoid the backlight. Yeah, it just has to be glued on. Oh, well. <clears throat> Hey James, I had to move it a little bit because you were back with badly. That's fine. People won't be able to see me then. You're not John Cena. I don't know what that means. Yes, you do. Ooh. We've got another Zy We got a white, another zombie pirate. I'll, I'll hold it closer yeah. to the camera because I'm at a better angle for it. You got good sense to be going sailing soon in the Pathfinder game. Exactly, all these pirate minis you found have been pretty good. Yeah. Okay. I had not had a duplicate with these two. This is Ghoul. That one's pretty good, and actually, that's pretty close to how I uh, described Ghoul sh uh, looking in the game. Yeah, it is. My favorite was still when it just read Zombie and I misread the, um, the series. Prefect has it being its name to give us off oh, the zombie. Yeah, that was funny. I enjoyed that. Alright, let's get into the here. Horror Clicks. First one up is Horror Clicks Nightmares Booster. Okay. I didn't know Horror Clicks went as long as Hero Clicks went for the five figure boosters. Apparently. I never actually. I played it once or twice when they started bringing the license things in. Pen, like a pen knife or something? Um, no, I don't, but I want. Oh, there we go. There you go, James. You can use this knife. Oh, that's not a knife. Uh, okay. So first up, ooh. Zombie scarecrow? Is it a scarecrow that died and became a zombie? Or a zombie that became a scarecrow? And it's on fire. Yeah. It's on fire, scarecrow. Oh, God. Swordsman? So, again, an another pretty good sculpt. It looks like a live-action, horrified version of Blade Man from Mega Man 10. Uh, giant Centipede, which I really like. Finally do my William Burroughs-themed game. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. So that's a favorite one that we're going to have to use. Yeah, that'll happen. This one's actually not a monster, but an uh, archangel. Though it's kind of like a Todd McFarlane angel. Oh yeah, th that that's bent like heck. Yeah, it, he's bent like heck. I, guess. I know Hor Horror Clicks did have a couple of characters that were monster hunters in the boosters. Mm -hmm. That might be either a monster hunter or some. There we go. Ven it's a bit fixed now. A vengeful angel, a a angel killing sinners. Yeah. But still a good one. And that's that one there. The winner of that one, I'd have to say. Wait, is that five or four? Oh, no, wait, there's still one. And this guy's called Guillotine. And he's like a Durhan like guy holding his own head and a guillotine blade on the string. Nice. So, winner of that one, I'm going to say, definitely is Centipede. Yeah, definitely. 
has the bystander tokens, and these are the horror cooks cards. Yeah, yeah. Which have it, and the hero clicks versions are somewhere. No, there's no hero clicks cards. Horror clicks was its own game. Oh, but I thought the horror clicks had. Uh... It's a matter of you could put hero clicks figures into a horror clicks game with no problem. Ah, but, but the horror. Versa? Yeah, the horror clicks don't translate to hero clicks. Oh well. But hero clicks powers translate to horror clicks. Oh well. I was hoping I could use uh, Centipede against, I don't know, Flash or something. I don't know why I did that. Did you need the knife? Uh, yeah. Opening up Wicked Fun Booster Pack. Oh, you'll like this. This is carny themed. And of course, right after we got through the, like, carny themed, uh, no, we'll just get this out of your way. murder mystery vampire hunt Pathfinder game. It's lots of fun. They <coughs> fought vampire clowns, murderous puppets. Oh, wow. What? Like, right off the bat, we have a winner with Mr. Fright. Like, just a really good, like, Pokemon type. Very exaggerated, long beckoning finger. I'm gonna pick your nose, kiddies. Ew. Thanks for making it worse. <laughs> Well, what we got here? Ah, oh, the, um, we'll say, uh, Muffy the Vampire Hunter. Oh yeah, that is definitely a Buffy. No, 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 it's a Vampire Hunter, not a Slayer. Hunter. This is very different. Oh my god, it's Zombie Luigi. <laughs> So Waluigi. Listening shambling zombie, but it looks like it, doesn't it? Oh god! It really does look like a zombified Luigi. Mario! Luigi! I never left the mansion, Mario! There should be one more figure. Yeah, oh, okay. it's, it's <clears throat> oh, it's stuck. Actually, this looks like a goodie, too. The, ooh, the Brine Witch. Like a Sea Witch Mer. That's going to be good for this, this yeah. sea stuff, too. <clears throat> a lot of the older Heroclix sculpts were better. Mm. Again, for what your purposes, those are useless. Yeah, well, we'll hold on to them. Yeah. Because I just know, like, last time I throw out a uh, box, it'll be, Hey, good news, I found all the rules to horror clicks <laughs> from last time. Knife, please. Ka thanks. And this is another Nightmares booster? Yeah, sorry, this is another horror clicks Nightmares booster. Oh no, the Horrorflix booster you opened before was not Carney themed, it was the yeah, original set. Oh yeah, I, am, I misunderstood you, that's from okay. the original set. Okay, still good. Although, and we didn't notice it because actually the, uh... Oh, shoot, what was it called? Mr. Freight actually does look like he belongs in a Carney set. Yeah, exactly. Oh! Jesse, I think we lucked out with one for you. Oh, God. What is it called? Is it called Giant Woman? <laughs> because we have the 50-foot ex-girlfriend. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, the 50-foot woman. God fucking damn it. Oh. This one actually has... This one has two uh, oversized ones. We also got the Sasquatch. Oh, my God. That is a wonderful yeah. fucking skull. Look at this! This is great! That was a really good one, because the giant is wonderful. Yeah. Or giantess. What have you. But the I'm doing the wily eyebrows. The fuck is that? Uh, the Black Knight. Yeah. It's actually very good. Just dual axe wielding, like, Chaos Knight type. Yeah. 
Monstrous mime! I am so, so angry I couldn't get to use this as the Perot clown. <laughs> you know what's too bad about this, though? What? Out of all these Vushis, we've yet to pull anything rare. Not that it matters for our purposes, no, I just think sure? it's funny. Sure, because I think the giant... No, the giant's a common. Really? Yes, yeah, I had her at one point. Oh, she okay. Was, she was a common. I actually had her with the intent <clears throat> of... What is that? Tin Man. What's wait? What's the name of the booster though? Spe this is specifically the Monster Tin Man. Oh, this is still oh, that's the end yeah, of the booster. Yeah, this is just nightmares. Oh, I want this figure. Yeah. Like I'm not joking. The Wizard of Oz is one of my favorite things, and Tin Man is my favorite character. Yes. I want this. Okay, which one we're opening? Of Horror Clicks, the Lab Booster. Okay, you didn't need the knife for that one. No. That one had an opening at the bottom. They're just popping out. To which we get the Hazmat Scrubber. But it's the also good thing, like, why I like the Horror Clicks, and even though we've gotten, like, supposedly no rares. Yeah. They're all good sculpts. They're all good. We have the werewolf orderly. <laughs> I wish that this um ah, I think I got my first I got my first duplicate. Oh. Just say that we hadn't got one, but got one from yeah, from Candy. Yeah, but she's a duplicate, but we never pulled her. She was from, from the, uh, my friend. Oh, okay. Or my neighbor who gave us this. We never pulled one from a booster. Oh, but the zombie state trooper, or zombie SWAT trooper, is a good one. Must arrest minorities! There's another one in the Wicked Fun boosters. I think the last one is the carnival. Theme. Yeah. So we're saving that one. The last there. Oh! What's that? The Vampire Enforcer, which is going to be a perfect sculpt for Bozar in the game. Oh my god, that is! We have our new Bozar. Oh my god, I love this one too. Bishop Lucifer, and this is a great sculpt. That's a super rare. Oh, that is? Yeah, the silver ranged in the oldest set. Okay. But yeah, I can see, because that's a really elaborate sculpt. It's really good. It's like, show that up to the camera. I, I have every intention of doing so. See, we got ease. Uh, removing the soul or a de possessing demon from the woman. It Plus, it's just like burly armed priest. Priest just basically soul punching up something out of a woman. It's great. This is listed as Dog Soldier, which is a Wolfman type soldier. Ow! What, what does the yellow ring around it mean? Uh, rookie. Um, the old here, the old sets of hero clicks had three experience levels for each figure. Yeah. You could get a rookie, experienced, or veteran. Yeah. Uh, and the base and yellow is rookie, blue is experienced, red was veteran. Um, okay. They have nothing to do with rarity. They're more okay. certain veterans were rarer than certain common than rookies, etc. But I like this one too for the constrictor, the snake around a candelabra. That is good. Sick and tired of these motherfucking snakes. Oh yeah, actually that goes well with the burly armed priest. Yeah. Empty, believe it is. Nerd out there. And the freak show booster one, which is the one I've been looking most forward to. Do you want to condense your trash when you're done? <clears throat> what did we get here? First one up there is Freddy von Bludo, which is a two-headed magician. 
Neat. Frankenstein, we have Herculon. I have half of a man. I like that skull too. Yeah. I think my favorite is either Tin Man or Sasquatch though. Jack Jack the Wolf Boy? <laughs> Which I'm definitely going to use for a goblin or a kobold NPC. <laughs> stands out and... Oh dear. Hungry Bertha. Oh! <laughs> Look at... The booty. The booty. The booty. This hero clicks has a booty. Stop saying booty. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a good pull, though. Yeah, we got a lot of good stuff. And the cards actually do give you some flavor text. Yeah, that's kind of why it was. I hope to wrap the cards, see if there's flavor text that might at least give ideas. Oh. I'm trying, I'm flipping through the cards real quick. It's garbage, I'll take that out on my way. Okay. Oh, I forgot some horror clicks did that. What? Some cards actually have two different power sets. Huh. The colors stay the same, but they mean different things. Dr. Hartley Quinn for Candy Stripper. Well done. Well done. You should be ashamed of yourself, but well done. Flavor text on these is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. I'll let you read some flavor text before I end the stream. And close the knife. Read it out loud. I always wanted to stay in the background, not call attention to myself. And these guys filmed me walking through the forest one day, and well, that plane was sure up to heal. I mean, I understand their curiosity. It's not like I'm normal. Whatever that is. Well, that doesn't mean I don't do some good. That I don't have a job to do. I used to be able to really help people, but now I have to spend so much hard time hiding from these Bigfoot hunters, I can't do really do that very often. Eventually I'd like to get back to the way things were, but I don't think that's possible anymore, you know? Frickin' paparazzi. <laughs> that is a good flavor text. <laughs> oh yeah, and it's a uh, Monster Hunter slash Guardian card. Okay, so that makes sense. It says it rescues minions, it rescues civilians. I remember Horrorclix having all of those little tokens or civilians yeah. that the monsters can either slaughter or save. Alone in a grove, a tin wood man stands. 
Frozen in mid-swing, axe still in his hands. His body, his joints all turned to rust. Leaves pulled around him with every gust. If you find him and know what's best, stay away, for if you open his chest, within one's beating hearts are all you'll see. The rust-dried blood dripped down to his knees. The heart is all he wants is true. With the swing of the axe, he'll begin again with you. <laughs> I like the Tin Man flavor text, not gonna lie. Upon entering the chateau, we discovered the remains of several bodies. In the center of the room was a creature unlike anything I have ever seen. It made no vocal sound as its lips were brutally sewn shut. It was gesturing wildly and pacing back and forth. After a moment, it became apparent it was trapped in some sort of invisible box. It was frantically trying to escape. <laughs> what card was that? That was the mind monster. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> that one wasn't so good. Yeah, I'm looking to see if I can find a good one. All right. Don't worry, guys. We'll find some stuff soon. Uh, unfortunately, the... Uh Priest one doesn't have flavor text. Yeah, because he's a dual card. Yeah. I think one is saving things and one is killing things for him. I skimmed it real quick. I can't believe the Horrorflix boosters called me out like this, though. With the 50-foot ex-girlfriend. can't believe Horrorflix cocked me. <laughs> Alright, let's read her Kelly. In life, her carry on the mighty bore not only the massive weights of his trade, but also the infinitely more important burden of responsibility for an extended family of twelve, spending four generations. In death, he still found strength to carry his burdens. The family was now in his belly. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh god. Freddy straightened his top hat and dusted off the tails of his jacket. He also straightened his brother's hat, looked over with concern at his conjoined twins' disoriented continents. They rolled into town late yesterday, spending all of their time setting up. Alex was going to need a proper meal soon, or it would become impossible. Freddy made a note to watch the audience extra careful that night. <laughs> Let's read the one for Hungry Bertha. Oh god, I read that one. Bertha strode through town, reeking of rotting flesh and sour milk. The innkeeper had been warned that she was walking about and so quickly extinguished his oven. Bertha bust into the outer room of the inn, screaming, I'm hungry. We will wear clothes for the night. There's no food to be had here, the innkeeper stammered. Oh, there's food here, Bertha said, smacking her lips. Meat is, after all, meat. This is a vor. For the scrubber, the hazmat cleaner. Or yet, headless zombies, vampire ash, werewolf droppings, or in the supernatural, meet some mess, we clean it up. I love that voice you made for him. That is a good voice. Wolf orderly doesn't get one. Okay, for the zombie trooper. Delta was still wearing body armor, so it was a headshot or nothing. Lieutenant Carter lined up the creature. It was still hard not to think of it as Private Johnson. In his sights, he waited for a good shot. But somebody else disobeyed orders and emptied an entire clip into it. Carter watched Johnson, the creature, which back and forth as the bullet struck him. His hands clenching, the trigger of the heavy 
clenching the trigger of the heavy machine gun he carried. Everyone down, Carter yelled. <laughs> okay, let's see, that's the mine. There will be tin man. The flavor text on these are so good. Let me read the Black Knight. So the Black Knight is specifically a well, a nightmare creature. Okay. Billy stood triumphant over the fallen dragon. Bloodless sword in hand, he posed heroically in anticipation of the arrival of the cute princess who would plant a kiss on his cheek and have her father make him a prince. Suddenly the sky grew dark and a chill-inducing roar echoed through the valley. Spot! Who killed my spot? <laughs> in his bed, Billy turned restlessly, eyes squeezing shut even as he willed them to open. <laughs> oh, that's dark. Doctor, Doctor Hartley collapsed onto the couch in the lounge, exhausted. Candy, you've pulled the same eighteen-hour shift I have. How come you look like I just crawled out? How come I look like I just crawled out of the grave and you're fresh as a daisy? I got everything I need. Just going from patient to patient, he said. Enjoy your break. I'm going down to the blood plank and say hello. <laughs> that was not as good one. Alright, who's this one? Ah, Zivimpa Enfosa. Suddenly the man was behind me. His too cold hand was cramped on the back of my neck. You will not believe that I am what I say, then believe the evidence of your eyes, he said softly. I could have snapped your neck before you knew I had moved, before you could draw and fire. I could kill your entire family as they sleep, but I have no per desire to harm you and yours, provided you follow my exact instructions. <laughs> That's Freddy again. Curriculum, seeing if any of that may be. The rest that we have, Werewolf Order, we doesn't get one. Dog Soldier doesn't get one. Delta. Yeah, only avoid. I only avoiding the uh, giant girlfriend one because it's a long one. Ah, oh, okay. Apparently, she's the only one left. Yeah, she might be. Yep. So should I read her? Go ahead. Oh wait, there's... Uh, oh, I have a few more over here. Okay. Which actually I don't know if they have double sight. No, they don't! There we go. <sighs> the Brine Witch. She stood on the dock, facing out toward Devil's Reef. There she croaked. Can you feel the call? I shook my head, hearing only the slap of the waves, striking the piling fifty feet below. But when she peeled back her lips, no longer human, and emitted a peculiar wailing cry. This time I heard the answer without difficulty. Within moments, a hundred similar voices answered from beneath the waves, each offering its own part in their otherworldly song of summoning. Not much time left. They broke through yesterday. Marty and I are the only two left, and he's just about gone. My hand is gray. I know they got me. I can feel it working. So hungry. But I can't keep anything down. Marty just made a run for it. Now it's just me. Don't think it's even going to be me in a few minutes. <laughs> Who is that one? One of the zombies? Yeah, shambling zombies. Alright, let's meet the Vampire Hunter. Who, yeah, is Megan the Vampire Hunter. <laughs> I don't care what you see in the movies, it's never as easy as you might think. Vampire's chest is rock hard and pounding a stake through it isn't like something you do in your garden. It's like the only that gives them a little bit of natural protection. But when you get that sweet arm motion down, it's almost second nature. If you're holding it right, you can feel the stake pierce their black dead hearts. <laughs> so, Mr. Fright. Tick tock, the clock strikes one. Tick. Talk the black strokes too. Tick tock, you better run quick. Tick tock, or it'll take you too. 
Yeah, that was kind of a really shitty <laughs> yeah, anniversary just like, ride. That was bad. Yeah, God! Just like, why did I bother doing a voice? <laughs> For the zombie scarecrow! Farmer John's tractor, which all the ladies found sexy, <laughs> rumbled merrily along the quaint yellow brick path that marked the edge of his forty acres. He came to a stop near the silent sentinel scarecrow, noting a small wisp of smoke in the corn. He sighed and grabbed his shovel to go collect another charred crow. Ever since the old scarecrow had suddenly reappeared, and after an inexplicable absence, things had been different, if a little odd. Still, no crows ever got his corn anymore. <laughs> I like that. The swordsman. It sounded like a good deal at the time. Live forever, do whatever you want, no repercussions, everyone respects you, dreams come true, right? But then you sign on and you got no control. So here I am, the swordsman. Big frickin' whoop. Look at me, I got knives for hands. Sure, it's cool for like the first 20 minutes, so you're walking around chopping up tables and walls and books and stuff, and then you're like, next! But then there's no just next, just knife for hands. I need a nurse for everything. EVERYTHING! Why do you think I'm so best? <laughs> the centipede is just, and I thought the cockroaches were bad. <laughs> Alright, the archangel. Kyrie gazed hungrily down at the girl cowering on the floor. She licked her crimson lips and grinned, exposing her prominent vans. Suddenly a light appeared above them as the silhouette of a muscular, wigged man descended slowly and aligned behind the girl. Kyrie shielded her eyes from the brilliant white light and hissed as it began to burn her skin. Vengeance is mine, saith the Lord, boomed the archangel firing first from its weapon. Eat hot death, bloodsucker! <laughs> Head resting in the guillotine, Hank closed his eyes and chanted over again. This is all a dream, this isn't real, this is all a dream, this isn't real. His last memory was the feel of straw against his cheek. That's for a guillotine. Now, I know, I but I'm just trying to think of what the straw was. Oh. Boom. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Had fallen off. Okay. So, that's fun. You want to read, girlfriend? No, not really. Okay. It's a long one, it's not particularly good. Yeah, it's from the, what you call it's point of view. The father or something, I don't know. The, the boyfriend, it's... <sighs> it's not as good one as the other. Oh god, I'm disappointed with that one for uh, Mr. Fright. Yeah, anyway, let's end it. Jesus Christ, come on! Two, two. Okay, Oh, actually, the mask does work good for horror clicks. Yeah.